It's finally time for the linen closet reorganization, clean out, and makeover. Why is a hammer in my linen closet? You got me wondering. You got the hole! This is a first aid kit. And so I can go out and be a hot girl from time to time. But how many times do you bathe a week? Think about that. Flimsy. Because I already seen how you had those. Look, when y'all fold y'all pillowcases, cases, don't fold this one and fold this one. They are packed. Mm -hmm. Put them together. Girl, we're definitely judging. That's just how we live. Money and pretty money. So today we are tackling the downstairs linen closet. Judge me if you want, just make sure you stay tuned for the after. And I also got help. We got D-side in the house. We are gonna rock it all the way down. I just got here. They don't go in your laundry. So what happened was Dominique was doing her laundry. I know what happened. I'm running late, so I'ma just do whatever the heck I want now to she this started off being shampoos and conditioners and then it just turned into a uh, everything that was large it's giving oral hygiene hair care hand soap <laughs> more shampoos and conditioners are in this one then it turned into a exfoliation glove that's supposed to be here with the hand towels and then this is face mask foot mask all of that bunch of everything do what was supposed to be my cleaning caddy pedicure thing on top of another caddy my mouthwash container because i got sick of using that as my mouthwash container but now i think i want to start using it again since the bathroom looks amazing and then we got our first aid kit over here my waxing essentials is back there and my steamer <sighs> I know you're judging me, but it's okay. We're definitely judging. But I don't see the wipes. You right. Why, the the, why you wipe that in? When you wipe with these, you throw them. I throw it away because some people say you shouldn't put wipes in your toilet regardless of what the plumber said. Some people also say you should only bathe twice a week. But how many times do you bathe a week? You got me wondering. No, I bathe <laughs> twice a day. So stop listening to people. You right. That thing says what? Flushable. I don't flush flushable wipes that though. That thing say plumber approved. No, did. Your mama told me not to use that in my toilet. Mama them didn't have this kind of stuff growing up. She probably thought this was a baby wipe. Uh, this is new age stuff. Mama them actually had to know how to wipe back in the day. Uh, now you ain't got no other wipe. You just get you a little wet wipe. <laughs> <laughs> I pray you don't let nobody reach up here and, 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 and get their own towel, get their own mess. Because you, you got to do better than, than what you're doing. You're right. My sheets rolled together though, look. Well, that ain't fault. Mommy taught you nothing. What she taught you just won't pay attention to this. Well, Mommy's saying I ain't raised them like that. I know she didn't. Should I have ordered the bed sheet boxes on Amazon? You don't need to order nothing else. Right, wait, well, I'm really getting this one. For real. This is crazy. For real. It's really ridiculous. Oh my god. Boy, look at that. Is you even using the band? The band bent the all man. One braid like that at home. <laughs> hey, what mom say? Hey, hate to follow a joke at home. Look good when you see him fall off. <laughs> God, Lord. <laughs> it was real organized at one point. Six, at one point, I know what happened. What happened? Rush. Don't want to stop it. Don't want to stop it. You reach in here. Nah, what happened? Get some. You just throw it back. What throw happened? it back. I feel like what happened is I got too much stuff, so it started off organized until I ran out of space. Cause you I got, got five shelves, Destiny. That ain't too much stuff. You with five shelves? And I know this ain't my black tie. I just know. How about that? I'm live, boy. I don't care. <laughs> Let me find out. Cause I ran out of space. You didn't run out of space. You ran out of time, busy running the street. Still taking care of your house. How do you think the pillowcase got folded? Just the bin, I like just ended up with too many. And I don't then know. the bins beat it all off. You busting the bins out. I was trying I to. I hate to open up your drawer, but you busting them drawers out. Now, my drawers on point. Mm -hmm. They are. I recently did them three months. Call them home. You see where they hard at. You don't even know I'm about this here. Get dressed and leave. That's what you're doing. Too busy ripping and run. Is this a first day, kid? I hate to see the day you take sick. I ain't gonna be able to find <laughs> I'm just joking. I'm jamming. I know. Amen. But what they say behind every joke is what? Uh, truth. A little bit of truth. Why is a hammer in my linen closet? That's what I was going to ask you next. It should be outside on this thing in the shed in the garage, huh? No. I just hate when I have to need the hammer, I got to go all the way to the garage to get it. Think about that. And I 
because I hate to always have to get up and go to the bathroom in the middle of the night, but you don't see me wet in the bed. <laughs> Convenience isn't always the answer, but pops and glue. All oh, that. This is what I need to sign back up for. Don't you know, girl. Stress relief. Girl! <laughs> what stress? You stress because I ain't clean. <laughs> That's what your mama say. Stress relief ain't never hurt nobody. Uh, wool ball for your child. Smell it, it's scented. Buff City. Wide hook. Go to the body. Okay, Manny Peggy. Javante Dave. Why this in here? Oh, I ain't know I had that. I'm not no new thing. This up in your own, what you call? In the beauty room. Yeah. Girl, what's your mama here, man? Your mama talks. No, <laughs> So now everything is pulled out of the linen closet, went ahead and swept it out, and now I'm going to do a quick haul to show you some of the items we'll be using today. So at Walmart, we got three of these white bins. The decorative baskets by Mainstay, by Mainstays. This size, which is pretty large. 11 and a half by 14 by five. So three of those white ones. I tried to keep my colors kind of neutral so that it'll all go together. I, I like this one a lot, but I only saw one by Mainstays as well, the medium canvas storage bin. And then I got two of the large paper rope baskets also by Mainstays. And I went to Dollar Tree after that. So tans, whites, grays. I got these. Y'all know the price on the dollar tree stuff already. I just thought this was cute. I don't know what Boom might be able to do with it. Candy, cookie, cotton ball, something in the jar. And then I got two of these little white ones that has the grip on the inside and some of the stuff was just extra stuff I wanted. I got one gray one like this. Things that didn't matter but y'all probably still want to see. A uh, cookie pan. I got a 10 pack of the dish detergent pods. 10 pack of the toilet bowl cleaners. I actually use these. I like these so this is like my third purchase of these. And I haven't tried this yet. I'll let y'all know how I like the toilet bowl cleaners. Dishwasher pods. 20 of those. A pack of the trident gum. And I saw something else that fell. Oh and I just got some vitamin C drops. And that's it. So once you pour everything out, you're really just going to be like, oh my God, whoa, like where do I even start? Which is why I reached out to my sister Bone for help. If you saw me do the bathroom cabinets by myself, I was like, yeah, no, I'm not tackling the linen closet alone. This is Bone's lane. When you just know what someone is good at, I was like, yeah, Bone is the perfect person to help me with this. So this is where we're kind of categorizing different items, separating different things out. So all of the shampoos, conditioners, medicine. So we're going to use that container instead since it's larger. I feel like when you first settle into your new space, which for us, we moved here in 2021. I'll link the moving vlogs down below. Things start off looking amazing. You get unpacked. Everything is nice and neat. And over time, some spaces remain neat and organized and not chaotic and then other spaces just end up looking a hot mess and the linen closet is one of those spaces for me hey, every once in a while a quick refresh reset is a little necessary here's to that so in order to not overwhelm yourself because you can stare at your floor and be like where do i start Boone's idea was category by category. So once I gathered and separated all of the medicine, the next step is to grab a bin that you think will fit the items and then just kind of put everything inside. And then we had a section sitting over to the corner where we would kind of place the completed bins. And then after that, choose another category and keep going until you're done. So this cute put. Mm -hmm. So you want me to roll the towels and put them in which bin? I'm gonna show you how to do it. How many just start rolling, rolling for now? You know what? I don't want them flimsy because I already seen how you had those. These are the ones from Dollar Tree. I tried to do like an No, no, these are great for things that are rigid themselves. But okay. when you had them towels, see how this one is now bust out? Make it out, yeah. Get just a, a rigid one. Like you can use something like that or something okay. that's, that's what you call more. Mm -hmm. So if we roll the towels, would they look nice in that? Yeah, that's what I was thinking of. So a deep one. Deep. Okay. So, all the other stuff hold it on, hold it on shape. All right, so I'm gonna start. But y'all know how to fold on So you said you want me to come back. Let me hot dog it then roll. So, what do all women be? Mm -hmm. Should I cut the tag off while I'm at it? Okay. Well, to keep it more new, you can keep it stuff on there. All right. I still got <laughs> the plastic on my TV. So you saying come like this? Hot dog then roll. Then roll. Right? <laughs> I mean, the, the concept, yeah, but the way you just. 
how you want it. You saw how when, when, when they hot dog, when you got the phone, they're like, that they hot dog spray it and did that. Then first of all, why you rolling the design and the amp on the inside? Didn't even pay attention to that. That's why you here to help me. I'm talking about needing to hire an assistant and my assistant sitting right here in my face. How much you charge? I'm expensive. You expensive? Nigga, when I say 1.5. <laughs> But I'm taking up hours of your day if I ask you to make me spend that on the weekend so I can go out and be a hot girl from time to time. <laughs> Jokes, I want to get your mother's like, What do you want? Oh, babysitter. <laughs> That's really what my mother's want. For real. Oh, babysitter. How about you come watch the heat? That's pretty. I didn't even think that I wasn't. Okay, so roll them all. Then we're going to decide which bin is best. Probably put them in now so they don't lose snoop. I don't have um, that many to take up one of the large. How many tabs ones, you get? So. I probably got like. You got lots 25, of 25, yeah. See, I keep the raggedy ones. You I see, hate when see. company grab the raggedy one. This is for the raggedy one. <laughs> now I'm saying if they grab it like, ooh, a raggedy towel. If you ever see a raggedy towel, if you ever come over, this is the kind of towel I put down on the floor when I'm doing my pedicure or something. Put see what that I'm saying? First. Put the raggedy ones in first. So the, that's your pedicure one? Yeah, this so is a pedicure towel. So you should put towel. that one in your pedicure thing. Put one of the raggedy ones up in your... Just put that with the pedicure stuff. Put the ones you're not so proud of at the bottom. Gotcha. Because when the company, they grab the good ones on the top. The top, okay. Mm -hmm. You know what I don't like, though? What? Black soap, good for your skin, but look how it do your... I know. It's washed, this. It's clean. Yeah, I just be liking it white, white, like my new ones. These from Ikea. I know. Back to hyperlapse. <laughs> I be trying to give a little bit of personality in it and not so much talking. If you've been to Target in the beauty section, you may have seen where they house the face mask. It's like this little rounded section that kind of sits in the middle of the floor and you can kind of like shop the face mask right there. So we kind of made our own little face mask little bin inside of this clear container. It's not new, but that one is from Dollar Tree, I believe. And of course, gotta have a bin for my nephew when he comes over. I finished rolling all of the hand towels and now we're going to move on to the tissue. Okay, this was my original bin. Was I ever good enough? Inside of this one, I think I was able to get about 12 to fit with just a little bit of overflow. Uh, so we'll just store that separately. Bone is working on the oral hygiene. For when guests come over, I like to keep extra toothbrushes. Yeah, what happened? Tell me, cause y'all plates hovering. <laughs> When you purchase your bins, just keep in mind what room you're working in, the different items that you have stored in that closet for what will fit. And of course, shop around your house. You may end up with some empty bins like we did with cling out underneath the bathroom cabinets. Some of those ended up working out perfectly to go inside of the linen closet. I was like, ooh, let's get fancy and use the shelf liners that we got from Home Goods, but girl, they don't fit. We were able to use these in the bathroom. We're gonna skip them for the linen closet because I wasn't in the mood to cut and trim. Moving right along. But we're gonna go ahead and start uh, sitting the ones that's organized inside of the linen closet. That way we can kind of have more space in the floor for other things. But yeah, we don't have the layout together yet, so we're just gonna kind of move things around and see what we like. Uh, but one rule of thumb that we're going to do what Boone was saying, the things that I don't reach for that often, they're either going to be like at the top or at the bottom. I only change my sheets on my bed once a week, so that's not going to be at eye level. I'm going to go up top with it. And then obviously something that's heavy will obviously kind of be on maybe the bottom row. All right, y'all. So before I start putting everything back in the cabinet, I got this little strip light. This is the same one that's in my pantry. It's already charged up and everything. Daylight, nighttime, then it's got on, off, and auto. So I keep it on auto and then maybe nighttime for it to pop on for you to see. It is a hallway light, but I'm going to install this just for additional that's what I got to decide first where I want my motion sensor to be when I come into the closet. Girl, I done dropped it. Girl. I was saying the light part. I thought you were going to do the light going like that. I'm making sure you No, I'm going to put it in here. Okay, yeah, okay. Yeah, I'm going to put it inside of here. Okay. I'm going to do my lawn just like this. Oh, uh, but if I do that, this door taller than the other door, ain't it? That's what I'm saying. That's why I was pretty measured, man. 
You can have it. Let me see. So it can be half and half on each side of the thing. Why are you finna have one side? Like because it is motion. Much. If it don't notice me, if it doesn't notice that you're right there, it's not gonna. That thing out. is right there. Okay. Oh, y'all mama. Put the thing. Put 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 the thing. Put the thing. Put the thing. Put the thing. <laughs> so that ain't gonna fit your feet or nothing. I see what you're saying. Come paint you with your nail because mine's peeling the sticky off of it. Start that off. You like them kid me charm. Can you let me go in there? Can you start my orange? Start so on. I could peel the rest. It might be the other end first. I had this a good couple of months, just ain't used it yet. That's probably why. There we go. I could peel the rest. Thank you. Me charm start my orange child. <laughs> Camera's not going high enough up, but um, yeah, like that. It looks great. Then pressing it down to the end. So this is magnetic. Boom! Can you come peel my orange? Can you start it off? I mean, if you don't have acrylic, I got it. I got it. I got it. I got it. Right there. Boom. And then when I need to charge it, take it off, plug the type C up just on the charger, plug it back in, stick it to the magnet. I can go from cool to warm lighting. I went ahead and turned off the light they were using to film with. Mind your business, this part broke, but the light still worked. And then I'm going to turn off the overhead light. So without any lighting on, if I want to grab something at night, this is what we have. Um, I just need to recharge this one as well. So you kind of just take this down, charge it up, and twist it right back on. Hey, fresh hard, you got plenty. Oh, okay. <laughs> what? She might be re-slashed three times. Just slide something else. I said, bro. Look, when y'all fold y'all pillowcases, don't fold this one and fold this one. They are packed. Mm -hmm. Put them together. They belong together. Okay? You need to put them together and fold them just like you do your sheets. Pop the wrinkles out your stuff. Mm -hmm, I won't be sleeping on no wake up. That's I, what my steamer is for. How I got this big line on my face. See, we have all that. If you fold that stuff right here, you ain't gonna need no steamer. But after I sleep on it, I like to get the wrinkles out daily. If you fold all these pillowcases like this, and you line them up in this closet like this, you ain't gonna have no wrinkles. But for the wet one, when you get them straight out the I'm wet. Straight out the dry. Exactly, that's the thing. You don't be on. It's just so you open up your uh, closet, everything looks nice. You want this? You look okay? Because you change your pillowcases more than you change your sheets. Mm -hmm. I do. I change my sheets every Saturday, but I change my pillowcases probably Saturday, then Wednesday too. No, we got to find the mate for her. Yeah. Hey, I know <laughs> no, 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 I change my sheets every every week. I ain't gonna say every Saturday because sometimes I do Monday to Monday. It just depends. But I'm saying every week. Yeah, once we'll a change week. it once a week. Somebody asked me, "Somebody told ask me, you change your sheets every week? You don't." When I did my Saturday reset routine, I had a bunch of comments. They was like, "That's doing too much. You got too much time on your hands." So you change your sheet every week. Yeah. You going seven days a week. I don't care if you is taking a bath. You sweating in that bed seven nights. Think about it. That's nasty. Why is this sheet crooked? Chick fil did not. But see, okay, if this was a clothesline back in the day, this is how we hung that sheet. Come here, that's the whole thing. Please teach me. Okay. Let me show you. Don't know nothing. And that way, you take two people. That's why people are neighbors. And they'll say, I help you with your laundry. Because mm -hmm. we'll hold this. Because when you took them down, hold this sheet. Right there. Paint it. Okay. This is how you take the sheet. Don't let it go. You know what? I'm supposed to, how I'm supposed to do this every day. Okay, no, I'm, I'm saying, hold it right here. Mama, that's, that's how, how you they hung on the clothes. This is why we ain't 
your Bible deep. So you took them off, you pulled them up, you're in your name, and y'all be talking, yeah, Gary, God, this, yeah. And you got that when you stand there and I'm going to walk to you, give you this end right here. Girl, yeah, that man done. This is that, and I tell you, hold that, you're going to that. You got to hold it. Cause I, oh, my God. This girl dropped the whole shit. Because I got distracted by the story. I was trying to see what the man did. And you would never get the hold gossip because I ain't never had one. And she don't let that shit on the ground. And, girl, I tell you, I went down there, and he didn't come home with that check. Honey, I told him, you better not come back in this house. Next week, I got all that money. And you fold that sheet up like that there. And then while you doing that, then she gonna move on. The, uh, you gonna roll fold. So who I supposed to get the tea with when I fold my sheets every Saturday? Nobody, Nobody, because you can't hold the sheet. See that? <laughs> now you see the difference in that sheet. So yeah, when you put this sheet on your bed, you ain't ready. Then you grit the basket, and never you come on to take the clothespins out. Take the clothespins out, do the next sheet. T-shirts was hung up by the tail. Yup. See, your clothes had to be hanging on line, right? Folks, the girl look like she hung no clothes on that line. Mm -hmm. So that show you crying was what? Low. Hang some clothes on line now. I'm gonna be gone. <laughs> then I hang no uh, Gucci shirt. T-shirt. <laughs> <laughs> Ain't no skims outside. Come on. We put our Levi's outside. What? Yeah. Ain't no good for the tennis shoes, too. You pin them up by the tongue. Then I wear my yeah. size, baby. Uh, people that steal no clothes off the line. Isn't that something when you think about it? But I, that's why we want to sit neither. Vitamin D. Them sheets must be white. Smelling good. Too. Yeah. The kind of bleached them. Yeah. Clothes, but you put them on. Ooh, like you had. That clothes smell feel so good. You know, I always wanted a line. You never let me get one. Clothes line. In a neighborhood like this, you park out a clothes line. That's why they got the steam in Oh, they don't know how to fold. They got steam because they're letting that clean clothes. I don't steam it steam. straight out of the dryer. I steam it when it's, uh, like, if I slip on it and I want the wrinkles out. If you fold this sheet like that straight out the dryer. I personally don't like that, she said. That blue, she said, is from the at-home store. Quality-wise, I dislike it. It's not soft. What's the material? But it's you know not what soft. Kind of it's that get? crisp cool. I saw crisp on the cool sheriff something. show. You know how sheriff be showing stuff what she said? Yeah. All the finished sheets had this little piece of elastic on the corners. So they won't move. You know you can buy that. I got some of those. You know what I'm talking about? You can buy that. Those are the type of sheets I said, oh, I'm going to start buying it. Because for some reason, y'all daddy works nah, as you know, I could buy you some on that clip. That clip, clip on. But they don't want them. They, they make, they make them. sheets. They, they made them. They made them. Huh. They got share as some sheets on her show. They made them. $29.99 a cent. If you ordered with the day that the show was live, though, right? Now they made them. Yeah. Yeah. Cause I had, I was balled up in the corner up over there. Like <laughs> 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 So once everything was folded, stored, organized, placed inside of the bins is the easy part, I think. <laughs> just put everything back the way that you would want it. So we're just kind of playing around with the layout until we had something that we liked. They slide in one. Y'all know we never use my big So you know what we gonna do? Why didn't we use my big pillowcases? Now take your hand and rotate the flat sheets. Rotate them the other way. You want the, the other way, the cute side. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> <laughs> there you go. Can't teach you. Now, now rotate those sheets. That's what I was thinking. I ain't said that loud. I there we go. Feel. Now we're going to put the pillow. Uh -huh. You know we didn't use my big, I paid $20 for those beans. Are we taking them back? You can't see nothing over them beans. We're going to put all the stuff That's in. That's annoying. Here. It's pretty in. Turn around. There you go. No, I don't try. Pillowcases. Straight up. Salmon. <clears throat> <Seven. clears throat> Sometimes different items fit better long ways at a wide angle, and then some things look better if you just kind of place them lengthwise. So just kind of playing around with it like that, the way you can maximize the space at the same time, too. Medicine. Overflow, shampoos, conditioners, caps, masks, all of that. And I also want to take this time to just give a shout out and special thank you to my sister, my mom, and Mr. Lincoln for coming over to help out. I could not have done this by myself. Like, it would have taken forever. On top of filming it, getting all of the different angles, we're using separate cameras for Instagram reels, TikTok content. It was a lot, but we got it done, and I'm thankful for the help. That's why I wanted to use those tall bins. It don't look pretty to me when you can see the... 
stuff. But you can see what you I thought you were supposed to see. That's why you had it. Oh, man, you can't see. Okay. Why you saying you wrote it? It's hit. Something like that. Why are you even in this closet every day? You ain't got this stuff in your bag, Yeah. <laughs> right. Where right. you want that at? In the thing. You can put it in the thing or next to it. With the foot, the conditioners? I'm saying it can go in that one. See how much space you got left? That's it? Oh. Yeah, I want Lincoln's toe in here. Bring that. Right, this my son's. Look, look in there, Des. That's another little thing. I don't know what you want out of here. We got D side in the house and when D side in the house, I'm finna get this done. So there's leftover wood in my attic that matches the rest of all of downstairs. And Boone had my mom to bring over this tool. She was like, yeah, I can fix that. <laughs> so she went ahead and finished the rest of my uh, linen closet floor for me. Oh, you don't feel? Uh, sponge. You could have to put a sponge on the end of it. Please stop by splash. Come in, I'll send you. start doing too much in the comments yes we are aware of all of the steps that you take before laying the wood down and all of the insulation and whatever else that you put down on the floor before you even begin to lay pieces of the wood bone is well aware that's not my lane i wasn't about to go and purchase all of that for this small amount of space okay i'm gonna work from the right to the left because i can do it like that and then it wasn't necessary to me. Nobody's walking on this portion of my floor. I just wanted the transition from the rest of my house to match. Is this a dog or treat? Come suck these corners out, baby. Oh. I don't play no game, nigga. Don't want me a ball. Yeah. Been there. Where the real tail is, I get it. I get it. Um, if y'all want to see her in full force, full work mode, she basically redid all of downstairs at home, aka our parents' house, and it looks amazing. Like, that's where she went to town and did, like, the cutting and all of the tools and all of that she has everything <laughs> she just had my mom to bring over a few things for her to kind of finish this so if she was able to do this without having all of her stuff that she normally uses when she does work like this mind you she's not nice. she's good with her hands gifted hands she's blessed okay so yeah shout out to my sister bone she's checking the wood not checking it girl from the measure she's measuring the wood <laughs> <laughs> my voice over gonna be so slow <laughs> Tell me when you want to measure, you flip it opposite of the way you actually want. This end going to go up there, okay? But you cut like this, because when you, let me show you. When I lay it, this the part that's going to go down in there and click, right? Mm-hmm. Bone explaining what's so going on. I'm not going to do the thing like this, but instead, I'm going to take this. Mm-hmm. Flip it. Then you draw your line. Okay. Okay. I, I ain't going to do this at home or nothing, but okay. <laughs> I know, I just like talking. <laughs> now nah, I was cracking the joke, because I'm at home, saying I ain't going to do this at nah, home. You got to get your transition piece. I don't know where they got. They didn't have no extra transition pieces up there. Unless I can look in the wood and make sure, but I don't think. Okay. But this one in the closet, thank God, so this gonna be, your transition piece going to be here anyway. Okay. So just make sure it's a brown one, something like that, or get the little, you know, whatever kind of you get. You want a mask for while you're working with the wood? So you see, imagine if this is cut off. Mm -hmm. Oh, my God. Never do that because you'll brush your lip. See, I did mm -hmm. like that. So when you put that up there, it actually fit. I keep, I'm keeping this. Because if you stick your finger up under here, mm -hmm. you can feel that this have this, this straight part on there. They're so going to snap together. Yeah, so when I put it in, I'm going to come like that and then pop to hold it in. Okay. Okay. All right. So technically, if I'm doing this the way, you won't need the witch car because that's going to be connected with it. But just still get the witch car. The, the transition. Uh, a transition piece to go here. So she got a wide lip because... Clearly, but I live about that way. You got a wild lip. So if you can't do this, folks, you just can't do nothing. I'm surprised you know how to walk with you going. Hers is ain't nothing but laying in what you call. Girl, you can lay this whole house so fast. You want a hammer? Oh, I do I want a hammer? <laughs> Y'all should have seen her face. 
You gotta come with a transition piece. Remember that T gotta yeah, stick in that hole. So she's not push it up that yeah. way. You can just leave it like that for now. A little bit right here. Yeah, because it's gonna move till we put the cord around on. You right, so let's have it even. Is it gonna in make between. the rest of the floor move though where they took that from? No, it's phone. a gap in between that and that. That's why you that have a transition piece. Just buy this piece when tomorrow. she use terms like that, I don't understand. She if she's ever able to recover those fouls, then y'all will see her lay an entire floor start to finish. So make sure you subscribe to Bones' YouTube channel. It'll be linked down below. Whenever she sets out to do something, she always does an amazing job. Check out my mom's Instagram. Y'all probably seen her taking pictures downstairs and you'll see the hardwood floors. Shout out to my little sister for really being handy and knowing what she's doing. I'm not even going to attempt to explain. I'll let y'all hear some of what she's saying because this is not my lane. What falls be? She's so quiet. I always tell my mama said you ain't got nothing nice to say. Don't say nothing at all. That's why I'm quiet. I'm trying to be respectful. Play with your mom and I with me. Better play with your kids and I with me. That's what you do. <laughs> play with TT, baby. You're my mom. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. With the cookie. <laughs> <laughs> and boom, just like that. In addition to me needing that transition piece and the quarter round, but by this time it was like nine o'clock at night. She needs to put. Tell them I know I need quarter round and transition piece, baby. You know. I said on camera so they can hear. Cause you can play with your mom and I with me. Yeah, I thought we was following the cleaning towels. Don't play with me. So before we do the final tour, I also decided since I had some space, I could add a few more things to this linen closet. So I decided to disassemble my bathtub setup. Not everything, like the candles stay, the bath salt stays in there. Um, but as far as like my tray and everything, we're going to put that in the linen closet. And lately I've been pouring some of my products back into their original containers because I don't feel like everything needs to be in a clear bin. But don't quote me on that. That does not apply to everything. Now okay, okay, okay. The finished look of the linen closet. Ah! I love it. Not me hitting the door. Let's get the tour going. So on the top row, I have my extra comforter set for when I want to swap out on my bed. And then next to that are all of my sheets. We have them categorized, fitted, flat, pillowcases, and then pillow covers for when I swap out seasonally. Next row, we have all of my towels, different colors. And then I put the bath bums inside of here now as well. We got the bath towels behind beside that. My overflow of bath mats that I step out on. We have the shampoo bin to the right. We got the everything overflow container uh, behind the face mask since I don't need that all the time. We got medicine to the left. A random radio for the winter storm when we thought the power was going to go out next to the medicine bin. On the bottom down here, we have all of my conditioners. I need to put those foot detox pads somewhere else and actually try them out. So then we also have tissue. Tissue right here in the middle next to my nephew's uh, bin that just has like his shower uh, essentials, toothpaste, all of that. Everything that he needs that belongs to him. Some of the larger items are down on the bottom like my pedicure thing, my handheld vacuum, and my steamer <laughs> that my mama was talking about. <laughs> And yeah, I love the way that this turned out. It's been a few weeks since filming this video. It's functional. I've been able to kind of reach for things and know where everything is. Not everything needs a label. Um, and then depending on my bins, I wasn't able to label all of them, but I did add a few labels as well. And I love the way this turned out. If you all want to see more makeovers and things like that, I will link some down below. We have done my bathroom cabinets. We've done my laundry room. Comment down below and let me know which space we should tackle next. There's actually a few closets upstairs too, so maybe we could do some of those. Y'all let me know what y'all think. that is pretty much it for this video i hope that you all enjoyed the way that the linen closet turned out i should have grabbed like a ring light or something um but yeah this is the star of the show not me if y'all want to see more transformations definitely be sure to check out the laundry room makeover as well we basically did a whole start to finish i ain't gonna take all the credit because boom definitely helped with this as well where all of this got started basically with us redoing underneath my bathroom cabinets i will link those on the screen and down below and I'll talk to y'all in my next video. Bye. Give this video a thumbs up if you all enjoyed it. If it inspired you to tackle your linen closet. Questions, comments, be sure to leave all of that down below. And as always, I thank you all so much for watching. <laughs> oh, let me stop smiling. Yeah. Oh, <laughs>